Uh, hello friends today in this tutorial i will be talking about that how to generate a bootstrap card inside a pdf document using a node.js library called as express pdf so if you go to npm.js node package manager official website and you search for a package called as express pdf so you will find the very first result which comes in this is a library that we will be using to generate the bootstrap card inside a pdf file so you can see that it has got 316 weekly downloads and all the source code regarding this video is given in the video description you can go to the video description and download all the source code regarding this tutorial so first of all you need to go to your command line and first of all make a simple node project and install these dependencies first is express and then express dash pdf so you need to install these dependencies and then I can just start my server by executing the command npm start so basically first of all what we need to do is that they have given the documentation I can just simply copy paste this code here and then I will show you how to go about the simply just control C and paste it inside your index.js file that's it and now you will see we have imported express we have just make a simple express app and we have required this module express dash pdf and then we have used this middleware we have passed it inside the use function app dot use pdf after this let me just start the application by app dot listen so it will listen on port 5000 if i refresh it you will see if i once again run this npm start so you will see it will have some errors because uh, we don't have this uh, it is the unexpected token is there we need to get rid of this options variable and also we need to create this uh, dummy.pdf because dummy.pdf open this file we have a sample pdf file which contains two one uh, page here you can see that we will be opening this pdf file inside the node.js server you can also open pdf files you can also construct pdf files from html strings so basically we are providing a html string here you can see html tag body tag and inside this we are passing this text here so if i run this here you will see once again these options is there and now we need to create this template from which we will be constructing our pdf so just to create this template.html file inside your root directory so here we will write the actual boot, uh, HTML code that needs to be translated to PDF. We, you can see this is a output file name. This is a property that it receives here. So you can just give it any output file name. We have given generated.pdf. So basically at this moment of time if I run this and if I go to localhost uh, 5000 and uh, if I go to the slash PDF route it will say to me that path is not defined because we are using this path dependency so we need to require it so path as you know that it is a built-in dependency of node so you can just require it by require path so you need not have to install it so once again if i open this route you will see it will open this dummy pdf file inside the node.js server so you can see that we can even open pdf files now we need to construct this template.html so whenever we open this route which is pdf from html so basically you can see that pdf from html string it has printed out this asdf string that we have provided here you can see that inside this html body tag so we can change this to anything let's suppose i change this to this if i again refresh it the value will change here you will see so simply you can click the download button to download this pdf file onto your local system so simply click on save and your downloaded generated.pdf so whatever name that you have given here this is the file being downloaded if i open this you will see this is the text being written here now we will uh, generate a actual bootstrap card here inside template.html so for bootstrap card we have a website called as w3schools.com where we will just copy paste this code here simply I, if i copy this you will see this is the actual bootstrap card so if i now
go to localhost pdf from html if i just remove this string here if i enter this you will see it will have this card here you can see the name of the person ceo and founder and now to get the actual image inside this user profile card there is a hack that you can apply here in express as you know that if i provide this uh, let me just move this uh, my file here which needs to be there it is there inside the downloads folder so where is so this is a proje project here so let me just copy paste this image here simply let me just save this image file inside this folder so this is my image here that needs to be embedded inside the bootstrap file card so i can rename this to profile.jpg so what we can do if i pass directly here profile.jpg it will not work dot slash so if I just refresh here, it will not work because Node.js will. If I just refresh here, you will see still the f image will not be found because if I open this directly, this image, which is hosted on the server localhost 5000, and if I slash profile dot jpg, you will find that it will say cannot get slash profile dot jpg because we need to make this as a public directory so all these files needs to be static files need to be stored inside the public folder in express so one line we can just write here first of all transfer this uh, inside your public folder create a public folder and just transfer this profile dot jpg file inside this folder now to make this folder as static we need to write a single simple line of code in express this is a middleware app dot use express dot static and then we need to pass here the name of the directory so the name can be anything but most of the times developer give this name as public write this line of code that's it and now it will treat your directory treat your static files be stored inside this profile public directory if i refresh here now now the image file will be rendered on the screen inside the node.js server and simply if i refresh here you will see my card will be there if i refresh so let me see here why it is not mm. oh sorry you need to simply to here we need to remove the slash here cut and simply we need to write here profile dot jpg simply you need to do this and now if i refresh it hopefully this will Uh, let me just see guys uh, inside my code here I think we need to restart the application for the changes to take place oh sorry we need to write the complete path that is why the 5000 profile.jpg because you need to write the complete path here for the changes to take place so this is the complete path if I open this path here the image is opening so I need to just copy paste the whole path the absolute path and now if I refresh the application the image will show inside the user profile card you will see now you can see that you can change this to any image of your choice you can change the name change the description basically this is kind of a bootstrap profile card which is there inside your pdf file you can take the printout of this file so many use cases are available inside real life applications you can always make a resume of this also so if i just tell you you can even embed tables as well so if i type here bootstrap tables 
so alongside with this image you can even have some beautiful tables as well so i found this library to be very helpful so you can just have a simple table as well so after this image so i can just after this image i can embed a table also i if i refresh here you will see more content will be there and now you will see a basic table will also be there this is a basic table first name last name email so in this way guys you can see how easy it is i think i have copy pasted in the wrong location this needs to go inside outside this card div that is why i think the styling was if you refresh it you will see the table will be outside this card and you will see this is a table the styling of the table has not been good but you can just play with this library which elements that you want to use you can just embed it inside your pdf document so thanks so much for watching this video